Hello, in this video, I will tell you about 3D LUT mobile application. 3D LUT mobile app allows you to use LUTs for color correction of photos and videos in your smartphone. Perhaps you've heard about LUTs or even use them for color grading. For those of you who do not know, LUTs are color presets, which are widely used by professional photographers and colorists to simulate film colors, making various looks, color calibration, and so on. What makes 3D LUT mobile different from other apps? The fact is that LUTs are loaded into the application from LUT Cloud. The cloud itself is constantly growing, so the number of color presets will only increase. Moreover, if you are a user of 3D LUT Creator, you can create your own LUTs on desktop and load them into a mobile app via the cloud for your personal or public usage. I will discuss the process in the next video. Let's return to the app itself. I open a menu. It is in the upper left corner. At the top of it, there is a guest sign. To log in with your 3D LUT Creator account data, you need to choose Login. I will show you how the cloud works in the next video. If you do not have an account yet, do not worry. Available presets will be more than enough for you. Next thing on the menu is Apps Preference. Here you can set compression of saved images and videos to a size of 1280 pixels on the longest side. You can also turn off the app logo on the saved photos. From the menu, you can go to the developer's website and read short descriptions of the app. You can load photos or videos to the application in two ways, from the gallery or by using a camera of your smartphone. I'm choosing the picture from the gallery. If you have a tilted horizon, you can rotate the photo on Rotate tab. You can zoom in an image to adjust the angle more precisely. Just go to any other tab to apply changes. I will go into Basic tab. I think it is clear how brightness and contrast work with an image. The white balance makes the picture warmer or cooler. Tint shifts the image colors to purple or green cast. If you want to reset an adjustment, you can just double tap on its name from the bottom of the screen. Saturation works just like in any other program. Black allows you to set the shadows. Tonal mapping allows you to lighten shadows and darken highlights. This is similar to HDR processing. Next, you can set sharpness. The texture allows you to increase the local contrast. Sharpen sharpens the details. Also, here you can add noise and vignette. I will consider them when processing black and white image. Now, let's go to the LUT tab. For convenience, LUTs are arranged in folders. Let's open some folders. I prefer LUTs from 3D LUT Creator Grading Edition and start applying them to the image. The LUT influence can be adjusted with a vertical slider. Note that in 3D LUT Mobile, LUTs are applied after the main corrections. What does it mean? If any LUT doesn't match your image, for example this one, then you can adjust the image on the basic tab so it will suit the LUT better. In this case, after applying the LUT, the image looks too cold. I go to Basic tab and make the image warmer. Then I'll increase the saturation. Since the LUT increases contrast, I will slightly reduce it. And I'll brighten the image a little. That's what is happening. To see the image before, you need to tap on it and hold for a second. Let's try to do black and white processing now. I'll load this image. Let's switch to the LUT tab and choose something suitable in the black and white folder. Notice that if I work with the white balance, I will change the brightness of the individual colors in the image. This way, the grass looks darker than the sky. And now, the sky is darkening, and the grass is getting lighter. This is happening because LUTs are applied after basic adjustments. I'll increase sharpness, add a vignette, and add noise. I personally like more contrasting images, so I will choose this LUT. Noise and vignetting can be further strengthened. That's what happened. Here's before and after. To work with a video, I will hold my smartphone horizontally. I load a video from the folder with the drone's video cache. This video is transmitted in HD format. I will go to LUT tab and select something from here. For example, this LUT. 
I will make the picture warmer and increase the saturation. That's what I got. One tap on the video puts playback on pause. This is before. This is after. That's it. In the next lesson, I'll tell you how to work with the LUT Cloud. 3D LUT Mobile is available for smartphones based on iOS and Android. Download right now from the App Store and Google Play.